VWAP, Value Weight Average Price, the most important and most popular indicator when you trade stocks, okay? Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use VWAP and how we can develop great profitable uh, trading strategy by simply using VWAP, okay? And also, I'm going to basically teach you how you can use VWAP for your own advantage to not only find the profitable daily trades, but to scalp the markets, okay? It's perfect and beautiful for scalping. If you like trading and different trading strategies, and if you're looking for the trading strategy that could work for you, okay, then make sure you subscribe to my channel, because as you know, I have shared so many trading strategies some of them are great, some of them are not that great, some are garbage, but there is a thing, okay? There's no ideal, perfect trading strategy, there is no such a thing. But if you can find a trading strategy, you know, that you could master it and it works for you, then sky is the limit. <laughs> So what is VWAP? VWAP identifies a true average price. So it's a true average price by factoring the volume of transactions at a specific price point uh, and not based on the closing price. So for this reason, it is a great tool for understanding the current and future trend of a security and the weight of where the most traders are priced. Just before we move on, move on okay? So what can you, you cannot use VWAP for all uh, assets, okay? That will be foolish. Because we have identified true average price, you know, uh, of something. For me, stocks, cryptocurrencies, commodities such as uh, gold and silver. So you can trade anything that where you can measure the volume of the transactions, okay? Now, let's move on, okay? So VWAP works as, as a support and resistance, okay? Often. So, looks as support resistance on a chart. If price is above VWAP line, we can consider that it's an uptrend, okay? If the, the VWAP line is this white line right here, by the way. And uh, so, and if the price is below it, we can consider that it's a downtrend. Again, very similar to moving averages, okay? But not, you know, slightly, but not exactly. And I'm going to show you why. So if the price only crosses VWAP, it doesn't mean that the trend is changed. So, yes, you may say, Andrew, okay, wow, nice strategy, okay? So whenever, whenever price breaks above VWAP, okay, um, Whenever it breaks above VWAP, we make a buy, nice, and we make money, okay? Or uh, whenever it breaks below, we make sell, and we make money again. Wow, nice, okay? So that's beautiful. One line, we place one line on a chart, and we generate profits like crazy, uh, even though, you know, it's not the case, okay? Because we cannot do that. There will be so many fake outs and so many fake confirmations because to use VWAP as a singular standalone indicator strategy is, is not enough. You're gonna lose your money. However, you know, you have at least 50% chances to, you know, to win your trades, at least 50. But as you know, 50% is not enough to be profitable. You need to, you know, in order to be profitable, you need to be at least 55, 60% profitable. It depends on your broker commissions and, and spreads. So for example, here you can see the VWAP, uh, the VWAP broke out. No, I mean, we placed buy, but then it went down, okay? Oh, sorry, that's a weird picture right there. But you know, you got the idea, okay? So this is fake out, so people would sell here, you know, scary people who will sell, however, it did break out afterwards. So what can we use to confirm that, yes, if this, you know, once the price broke out, yes, that would be a great buy opportunity, okay? So we need, for that, we need to use uh, something else to support it. So what I'm saying is, you know, the VWAP, whenever we, whenever we see the breakout from VWAP, for example, okay, we want to place buy trade here, okay? For example, from this breakout. So here we see that Ethereum against dollar, uh, you know, broke out here nicely. So we want to, we place buy. But whenever we place buy, we want to know that it's a bullish trend or it's a bearish trend. So we, when we place the trade, we want to know, is it an upward momentum or it's actually a downward momentum? And how can we know that by looking at VWAP? And the answer is we can't. But for to support that, we can use something else. And that something else is going to be, of course, the one and only, 
the beautiful beautiful baby EMA 200 200 exponential moving average line and now baby oh boy that's where the magic happens so look at this right now if we have VWAP and 200 EMA showing us the same trend that means we have two strong confirmations for that direction and we can place the trade in that direction so trend is our friend here so look at here look here okay so here we can see that um, price so this yellow line is 200 moving up in 200 exponential moving average the white line is VWAP okay so I look at this okay look how price is touching here the exponential moving average and bouncing back up uh, bouncing back down sorry but whenever it breaks out that's confirmation for bullish trend which happened in here however the price was still below the VWAP but whenever the price breaks above VWAP and above 200 EMA which happened here at this stage that means it's a beautiful beautiful you know uh, uh, you know beautiful beautiful opportunity to make a uh, the buy trade so buy trade so where should we take our profit for a buy trade for a buy trades we should take our profit at the previous swing high to see previous swing high simply zoom out okay so where was the highest point from this point where was the next highest point from this point zoom out not here not here not here these are all below but however here was a higher previous higher low so this line should be our uh, this line should be our uh, take profit level. So let's put it here, pum, like so. Really simple. Uh, of course, for that you can also use Fibonacci if you're a newbie. Uh, let me know. I can make another video about that. Uh, so here we go. So uh, yeah. So now let's let's continue more. Let's continue on. Okay. Now here we see this is our take profit level. So uh, here we can see. The price above 200 EMA and above VWAP. However, now we see the price breaking down. Okay, we can still wait. Here again, it's breaking down, we can still wait. But here, however, it broke below VWAP and below the EMA. It actually happened here as well, but there was a fake out. But we know that this is extremely powerful trading technique, okay? So anywhere in this box, if you place sell trade, we will be deep, deep in the money. This is ridiculous. So the thing is, is that we are going to use scalping time frames, time frame charts, you know, to get the scalping trades more frequent. So by by other words, is then by you know, if you use um, larger time frames, this strategy is um, is uh, more accurate, right? But there is a thing, okay, which I haven't told you. VWAP is value uh, weighted average price, and VWAP will always tell you the same price no matter on what time frame and we're gonna you know use this for our own advantage to make frequent profits all over over again so uh so for that uh, you can use uh, five to 15 minute charts this is 15 minute chart okay 15 minute chart and you know by using 15 minute chart you will have more bread you will have the same amount of breakouts when it comes to vwap yes but you will have more breakouts when it comes to 200 moving average and that's where the magic happens and that's where we get frequent trades you know during the day all day long it depends what you trade so you have breakout in here then we have breakout again in here and in here you see but uh, you know but when you look at the larger time frames okay we're not you're not gonna see that okay because the problem will be the yes the 200 EMA okay for a price to break 200 EMA on an upside or uh, on upside sorry here or downside in here it will take some time but we're gonna break it down to 15 minute chart because we are using VWAP to confirm the breakout on both so VWAP alone is losing VWAP looks at the previous price and the volume the EMA 200 only looks at the previous price. We combine all of them together, okay? So let's just go back here. So, so look on, on look on 50 minute chart, you can see nice, 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 beautiful trades. And I would especially, you know, advise you to focus on the VWAP and EMA 200 crossovers. VWAP and EMA 200 crossovers. 
those crossovers are, are for those newbie traders, for those who are very, very, you know, risk averse people and, you know, scared to lose, you know, every single penny because, you know, because the crossover, well, the crossover will confirm that the direction is extremely strong. However, uh, it'll be a little bit too late to place the trade because, you know, the price will usually act first and break out first before the crossover happens, as you can see in here and in here and uh, so sell and in here okay uh so beautiful beautiful so swing low swing low take profit and again if you're a newbie then make sure that you use fibonacci retracement okay to uh, set your st take profit levels uh because you know that each the each of the breakout it means the price could go up to the next uh, key level each of these lines are key levels so take your profit and set your stop loss levels according to these key levels shown you by Fibonacci retracement. If you need help in trading, you're always, always welcome to email me. My email is always the same. And if you want to join Academy and copy my and my colleagues' trades from our Signals trading group every single day, then you're also welcome to join. Uh, the link is below the video in the description box. But always remember, okay, it's education practice. That's the key for long-term success. I love you all. Bye-bye. And God bless.